the brave little boss baby. This is a story about the adventures of a four-year-old young man named Sile. Yes, you heard it right kid, he's just a boy but is growing up to be a fine young man. Hi, my name is Zyle. I want to become an engineer when I grow up. How about you? Zyle grows to be a responsible fine kid. Every day when he wakes up, he instantly brushes his teeth and sweeps the floor. Brush your teeth, brush your teeth, brush your teeth, brush your teeth, every morning, every night. This is the way we sweep the floor, sweep the floor, sweep the floor. This is the way we sweep the floor, early in the morning. He also knows how to tidy up his toys after playing. How amazing. I have to tidy up my toys. Mama Ba, my lovely and pretty aunt will get angry if it's a mess here. That's what she always tells me, tidy up your things or I can't play, ha <laughs> ha. During the day, he rides his bicycle with his handsome cousins Appa Andre, Cutie Twite, and his friends Carl and Charles. He didn't know how to ride his bicycle when he had it first, just like any other kid of course. But Cuz Andre and Cuz Twite and his friends are always there to teach him. Come on, Zyle! You can do it! Go! Go! Yeah! Great job! Yeah! Come on, Cuz Andre! Let's race! Alrighty! Whoa! Zyle loves to sing also. He has a wonderful voice, but he always says he can't dance. So please don't laugh at me, he says. He also loves to eat pancakes and he likes making his own pancakes. Mom. I want to eat pancakes. Can I make one? Sure, baby. I'll teach you how to make it. Thanks, Mom. So I will need to mix this, right? Uh-huh. And this one too, right? Yes. Be careful with the heat and the fire. Okay? All right. Yeah. I did it, Mom. Hmm. It tastes delicious. Can I share this with Cousin Dre and Carl? Sure, baby. Zyle loves eating. Hmm. This is good. This is good. I want more. He is not a picky eater. He loves sharing his food to his friends. He always says, Sharing is loving. Such a good kid. However, Sile is afraid of the dark. He loves playing with his cousin's house just next to their house at night, but when it's time to go home. Mom! Can you please pick me up? I'm scared. I'm... What's that? Huh? Mom? Could there be a monster? No. Go away, please. Um, no. I can do it. Come on, Zyle. I'm a superhero. I'll run as fast as I can. Ready! Count with me! One, two, three! Whoop whoop! So Zyle run as quick as he could until he gets back home. What happened, dear? Is everything all right? Yes, Mom. All good. No worries. One day, Zyle's dad has to go back to work and be on board the ship. So Zyle's dad told him. Zyle, I have to go and be away for a few months. I need you to be a good boy and take care of your mom and your baby sister, okay? Can you be brave and be a big man for me? Of course, Pops. I'll take care of mom and my coming little sister. I'll help mom with the dishes and help her wash our clothes. I can be a big brave little boss baby. Good boy, son. Then one day, Zyle had a serious talk with his mom. Mom, how's my baby little sister in your tummy? 
Is she okay? Yes, baby, she is strong and healthy. So, mom, what if your tummy gets hurt and my baby sister wants to go out already? Do you think I can carry you? Oh, baby, you don't have to carry me. All you have to do is go to your grandmother's house just next to us and call Mama Ba. Okay, Dad said I need to take care of you while he is away. So from now on, I'll help you with the house chores, Mom. I'm a big boy, right? Thank you, baby. Mama loves you so much. I love you too, Mom.